Namaste. Welcome back to my channel. In our previous video, we solved the 46th question from ISA Aptitude Test 2022. And in this, we are going to solve the next one, that is 47th, which is based on radioactivity. Consider that in a fission of a single uranium atom, single uranium 235 atom, 200 mega electron volts energy is released. Assuming all atoms of uranium undergo fission, which of the following options is the closest estimate of the amount of uranium required for a uh, 20,000 units of TNT explosion? One unit of TNT corresponds to 4.184 into 10 to the power 9 joules and one electron volt as you might be knowing is 1.6 into 10 raised to negative 19 joules. Okay, so we are required to estimate the, the mass of the uranium that will be equivalent in energy to this uh, uh, 20,000 units of trinitro turbine or TNT. Okay, and we have options half a kg, 10 kg, 1 kg and 60 grams. So this is a simple energy balance equation, no half-life uh, whatever involved here. Okay, fine. So let us first calculate how much energy is actually released when we, uh, okay, uh, when we explode 20,000 units of TNT, okay. So, one unit corresponds to 4.184 into 10 to the power 9 joules. This is one unit of TNT and how many of them are being exploded? 20,000, okay. And because we want to find an uh, equivalent energy uh, in fission of uranium atoms, okay. Let us now assume that there are n such uranium atoms which we will uh, well, which will undergo fission, so capital N, the number of atoms which will undergo fission because they are saying all atoms, okay, so N into. Now we would like to calculate the energy that we get in uh, one from one fission of uranium atom, okay. So uh, one fission 200 is mega electron volt, so 200 into 10 to the power 6 electron volt, but we would like to have this in joules as well, so we should multiply this by 1.6 into 10 to the power negative 19. Uh, so this will also be in joules now. Okay. Remember, n is the number of atoms which we would like to find. 200 into 10 raised to 6 into 1.6 into 10 raised to negative 19 is the energy that we will get through fission of a single uranium atom. So what will be n now? n is equal to 4.184 into 10 to the power 9 into 20,000. 20,000 upon 200 into 10 to the power 6 into 1.6 into 10 raised to negative 19. So let us calculate this now. Okay. 4.184 into 10 raised to 9 into 20,000 upon 200 into 10 raised to 6 into 1.6 into 10 raised to negative 19 okay 10 raised to negative 19 that's 2.615 into 10 to the power 24 2.615 into 10 to the power uh, 24 so these are the number of atoms so how many moles of uranium are will be required moles of uranium will be this number 2.615 into 10 to the power 24 upon Avogadro's number 6.022 into 10 to the power 23. Okay. So let us divide this by Avogadro's number 6.022 into 10 raised to 23. That is 4.342 okay 4.342 this is the number of moles now we can say that the molar mass of uranium is 235 grams correct molar mass is 235 grams molar mass of uranium 235 is 235 grams okay and how many moles do we have 
4.342 so the actual mass will be 4.342 into 235 so this into 235 that's 1020.466 or well, 1020 we can take it as 1020 1020 grams or approximately 1 kilogram so the closest is 1 kg now I agree that this is a computationally extensive problem but otherwise the logic is very simple energy balance but you need to be extremely careful while calculating things that is question number 47.